Blessed John Baijing, a true pioneer in caring for lepers at a time when no cure for leprosy was available and those afflicted were banished from society. Baijing was born on May 15, 1850 in the former South Territories of Polish Republic in what is now Ukraine. He belonged to the family of Counts John and Olga Baji. He was homeschooled initially, but his parents had to separate after the political uprising in 1863. He moved to Kiev along with his mother and siblings. Having completed his secondary studies there, he entered the novitiate on 10th of December 1872. He was ordained on 26th July 1881 at Kharkov. For 17 years, Father Baizi worked as an educator among young people in the Jesuit colleges at Tarnopol, Kirov. Despite his wholehearted dedication to the work with the young people in Kirev institution, Father Baiji felt the growing need for something greater. He felt the need to sacrifice his self to God by serving the most miserable, scorned, poor, the least of these. After an exchange of letters with Father General Louis Martin, the 40-year-old Jesuit finally received the assignment he had long desired. In 1898, he went to Madagascar and was assigned to the Leprosorium on the outskirts of an abandoned desert area. 150 patients lived in extreme material and spiritual poverty without access to the most elementary medical care. Father Baizi tried to help the poor souls and make their sufferings easier as much as possible. He admitted to feeling repulsion at first and fainting several times when he saw the victims. The lepers were amazed with his devotion and care. Having obtained the superior's agreement, Father Baizi started to live in the asylum in a small house close to the barracks which he himself built. He was the first priest in the history of missionary activities on Madagascar who started to live with the lepers permanently and who served them in spite of the fact that he could contract the illness. He even asked the Holy Mother to infect him with lepers so he could obtain graces for the better life, find salvation for the biggest number of sufferers. The experience he got working with the lepers gave him the idea of building the hospital for 200 patients where the poor could get the care and treatment. The construction cost was a huge sum of money, 150,000 francs. The project was far too ambitious for the resources of the mission, but Baijing would not give up. In 1903, he left the Leprosorium to go to build a hospital at Marana. Arriving there penniless, he found ways of collecting thousands of francs and his trust in God's help was unshakable. The hospital still exists today and radiates love, hope and justice, the virtues which made its construction possible. Baizim died on 2nd October 1912. His health had declined and he was confined to his bed. His remains were exhumed and relocated back to his native Poland on 8th of December 1993 at a Jesuit church. He was beatified 
on 18th of August 2002 at Karkov, Poland by Pope John Paul II. Blessed John Paisen, pray for us.